Well, a month ago, we were in the middle of the blizzard as it targeted the city of Buffalo. Channel 2's Kelly Dudzik checked in with the Department of Public Works today to see how they're using the lessons learned during the storm to keep up with regular snowfall like we're having today. Kelly joins us now with more on that. Hiya, Kelly. Hi, Kate. When I asked about this today, they said one of the main things they were focusing on today was communication. That's why they sent out those two Buffalo texts very early this morning. This pretty much is, like you said, a standard snowstorm for Buffalo, and the city knows how to shift its resources as it goes from snow to rain, then back to snow tonight. So the crews have been out all day since the snow started early this morning, pre-salting and salting the roads and plowing. And the DPW commissioner told me this afternoon that in a lot of places the roads are clear and the crews are keeping up with the snow. The snow is going to change and it's going to increase the next few hours. So we'll be, be on top of that, maybe shift to more of a plowing mechanism uh, if, if needed uh, on that and then monitor when it switches to you know rain. But there'll be that period of time between the snow and the rain where it could get a little slippery. So we'll 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 be on top of that and track that as well um, and then follow it through you know overnight. We'll, we'll, we'll be rain for a period of time through the overnight and then we'll, we'll pick a little bit more snow up in the morning too. So it's something we're going to track as the forecast and as the as this snow event kind of changes throughout the day and evening and tomorrow morning, we'll monitor it, we'll check it, we'll track it, and we'll, we'll change and, and, and move with it. Because we aren't getting so much snow that the city's crews can't keep up with it, they are not using private contractors this time around. But if you do have to go out tonight, the DPW commissioner just says, be careful out there. Live in downtown Buffalo, Kelly Dudzik, Channel 2 News.